Mel, we're about an hour this is and a good. half in. <laughs> Maybe like a mile and a half in. <laughs> how do you feel? Um, not dead. Maybe a little dying, but like we're still good. We're yeah. still good. All right. You just want to asphyxi asphyxiate yourself a little yeah, bit? Just a little bit. Just a tiny little bit. More sleep probably would have helped. Probably, yeah. Okay, Mel. Here we are at mile marker eight. Uh, How you feeling? Uh, no, right, resting right here. This is good. No, this is this is a perfect little area. We found right some here. shade, and the view is phenomenal. You just can't tell in the video. So this buffalo wandered into Camp Mill. Your thoughts on that this morning? These people need to stay away from it though. And I don't want to go to the restrooms because it's kind of close. <laughs> you know, just hanging out with a buffalo this morning. Scratching himself. Getting those hard to reach places. Okay, we have this view here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And Mandy, it's so quiet. It's day two. We're sore as hell. Everything hurts. Mel has multiple blisters. <laughs> Only a quarter mile in on day two and we're already resting, but the view is phenomenal and the silence is unprecedented. Hey Mandy. Hey we're, Mel. We're, we're here day now. Day two, we made it to uh, the airport in the sky for our bison burgers and our bison and our tacos and beers. So far, probably the most relief, most needed relief. So maybe we'll hit a ride a little harder, who knows. <laughs> I think we're getting stronger because, or seriously, the backpack. Seriously, the backpack, dude. What about the backpack? It feels so much lighter for some reason. Here on day three. Day three? And we haven't even like, eaten is, that much food. This is okay. And look at this view. And look at this gnarliness we're hiking up right now. I don't know if you can see how steep this is. Perhaps if we look up, you can no. see. It's real steep up there. This is probably the toughest 0.6 miles of the whole trail. We're gonna be walking along there. Oh, we're smiling. Uh, hey, we're here, here. Here we are. The highest point of the hardest day. Oh, God. And the view is amazing. And thank God there's this little bench, this little table with this little overhang. We're sitting on right here. We Jimmy Rick some shade because we're some badass bitches. That's right. We, we handle our shit and it feels good to be on top. Best thing ever. One and one and like, this is like three quarters, I think. Three quarters. Already wasted. <laughs> it's our campsite. We we'll sleep listening to the waves. This is the way to backpack. Right here, right here. Right here. Day four? Day four. Day four. We have rocks everywhere. It kind of it's a little scary actually. We're gonna sleep on this. But, but, this is our freaking campsite. And there's a cave over there. A freaking cave. And what can we find on the beach, Mel? Amethyst. Amethyst, Amethyst Jones. We are gonna find those. We're going amethyst hunting. Yeah. And this is our view for two days for the cave to explore. And so secluded. Over there. So we're about to take a walk on the beach looking for amethyst. <laughs> And a friend we met in the city came around with two bundles of firewood for us, just out of the goodness of her heart. We have to two total for two nights, but now thanks to her, we have four. We came up with oh, some amethyst. Look at this. A lot of amethyst, actually. And while we were looking for amethyst, we looked up and a seal was looking out of the water. And we had right wished at the us. dolphins, but the seal was perfect. Looked right at us. It right did. after the pirate ship she asked for a sail by. And it's so, seen across the sunset. Oh my god. It's this is so good. this trip has been more blessed than we know how to express. Yeah. It's sure. insane.
Party's over. Back to real life. What? Back to real life? Yeah. Back to real life.